I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Friday morning, the 19th of April, 2024, and this is your friend, Angus Buchan, with a thought for the day. We start off in the book of Isaiah, chapter 58, and I'm reading from verse 6. Is this not the fast that I have chosen? To loose the bonds of wickedness, to undo the heavy burdens, to let the oppressed go free, and that you break every yoke. Is it not to share your bread with the hungry, and that you bring to your house the poor who are cast out? When you see the naked, that you cover him, and do not hide yourself from your own flesh, your own family. This is the chapter on fasting, going without food. Now, to fast is very important. Jesus did it for 40 days and 40 nights in the desert. It is a very good practice. It brings the body into subjection to the spirit. It is necessary for each believer to do. However, the Lord says, but this is the kind of fasting that I have chosen. We've got to be doers of God's holy word. We've got to lift the burdens of the oppressed. We've got to share our food with the hungry. We've got to give a bed to those who have no roof over their heads. And we must not hide ourselves from our own families. Jesus says if we do this, then the light will break forth like the morning and healing shall spring up speedily. And then the glory of the Lord will be our portion. And then when we call on the Lord, He'll answer us. And He will say, Here I am. Today we need to be doers of God's Word. I remember my dear old dad just after I had led him to the Lord. And I said to him one day, Dad, we've got to fast as well now that we are Christians. And that old Scotsman looked at me with those blue eyes of his. And he said, Laddie, fast? He said, I fasted for three and a half years. (laughs) You see, he was a prisoner of war in the Second World War. And he was in prison in Germany and he was in prison in Italy. That didn't impress him so much as when he saw us taking care of the poor and the needy. That impacted my dad's life more than anything else. Today, yes, we must fast, but let us Fast, as the Lord says, take care of those who are hurting, those who are lonely, and those who are fearful. Jesus bless you, and have a wonderful day. Goodbye.